You want to know how to make a paper Minecraft server? In this video, we're going to show you exactly how. But first, I do want to mention that this server is using your own computer and your own internet and computer's resources. This means you're going to need a decent computer to run this server. And on top of that, only your friends and family can join the server because it's hosted on your own computer using your own internet. And anyone who gets the IP can figure out where you lived under your latitude and longitude coordinates. On top of that, you will need to port forward, basically meaning opening a port on your router. We have guides for all of that. But it is still a little more advanced, and if you're not comfortable clicking around on a router and, and things like that, it can be a bit overwhelming. But what if you don't have to deal with any of this? You just want to start a server quickly and easily and get it online within a few minutes. Well, that's where our company, Simple Game Hosting, comes in. Go to the first link in the description down below, the breakdown.xyz slash simple to start a 24-hour DDoS directed Minecraft server for you and your friends. You can easily add plugins to the server, mods to the server, mod packs, and truly customize the server any way that you want. Plus, if you have any issues along the way, there's expert live chat support there and the servers are meant to be up 24 7 and hosted on super high quality hardware so you don't have to worry about any of that either so go check out simple game hosting at the first link in the description down below the breakdown to the xyz slash simple and start your minecraft server the simple way nevertheless here we are if you want to start a server on your own computer here's how first go to this link here this is going to be the second link in the description down below this is our index text guide on making a paper server if you prefer text guides this is here for you otherwise click on the download paper button here to go to the official paper download page once you're here go ahead and select paper and then find the version you want we're gonna be going with the most recent 1.20.4 version right here when you click that download it will begin you may need to keep or save this file depending on your browser but it's a hundred percent safe to do that once the download is finished we can go ahead and minimize our browser and we want to go ahead and make a new folder on our desktop so right click new folder you can name this anything that you want but I'm gonna name it paper Minecraft server because that's what we're making here a paper Minecraft server once you've made this folder what we want to do is find the file we downloaded now for me that's going to be in my downloads folder but it could be anywhere for you where your downloads go so for me here it is we're going to drag that to our desktop and then drag that into the folder we created now from there we want to go to the description of this video because in the description of this video you'll have these codes and what this is is the amount of ram you want your server to have and that's going to be what we use to start the server i'm going to go ahead and get four gigabytes here that's usually best for plug-in servers but they can run on two gigabytes nevertheless let's go ahead and then come back into the folder right click create a new text to document and then we can open Open this text document paste that code from Java all the way to pause in this new text document and then click file save as and then save this as a run.bat file then you want to make sure the save type as is all files so file name run.bat save type as all files if you don't set both of these like this it won't work and then go ahead and click save we're not done there's still one more thing we need to do we need to rename this paper file but before you do that I'd recommend clicking view and then making sure file name extensions is checked otherwise when you rename this it can be a bit weird then you want to rename this to simply paper and then the dot jar there should just stay. So it should be a paper and then dot jar right like so if file name extensions are on. If they're off, it'll just simply be called paper. That's why I said come here and click to turn those on to make it easier. Now go ahead and double click the run.bat file and your server will attempt to start. But it's actually going to fail. That's because you need to agree to the Minecraft EULA. So let's go ahead let it load this stuff in here. If it doesn't load this stuff in, what you need to do is go to the description down below and get Java. Right now it's Java 17. It will soon be up updating to Java 21 needed for Minecraft. So in the future, if you see Java 21 here, that's because that's what's needed for Minecraft now. You can also run the jar fix. What this is going to do is take all the jar files on your computer and link them back to Java, making them work happily together. Nevertheless, we can now minimize our browser. And as you can see, the uh, server has failed to start. So we can go ahead and press any key to continue and it will close out of that. But we have these files and folders here, including eula.txt. Open the eula.txt file and assuming you agree to the Minecraft eula, which we do, change eula equals false to eula equals true. True, T-R-U-E, exactly like that, and then click File, Save. Now, when we double-click that run.bat file, the server is going to start. I'm going to go ahead and open up Minecraft, and then I'll show you how to join this server. Now, at this point, you're the only person that can join this server, so keep that in mind. But it's worth testing right now because, well, if you can join it, then we can move on to your friends can join it. If you can't join it, we need to fix that first, obviously. So here we are. The server is online and Minecraft is open. What you want to do here is click on Multiplayer, and then click Proceed if you need to, and add a server. I'm going to name this server local connection because it's using the local connection and only you can join using this connection then we want to make the server address localhost right like so exactly like that and click done now after a few seconds it will find this server and we can double click to join it you'll see us join in here on the left hand side and now we're on our server however your friends can't join this server in order for your friends to join this server you're going to need to port forward and luckily we have this a super in-depth video and text guide on port forwarding for any minecraft server it goes over exactly how to port forward how to find your 
your router settings, how to find port forwarding, what ports to forward, everything is covered. So check that out in the description down below. We've also got some other guides, such as a Minecraft plugins playlist that shows you all of our Minecraft plugin guides that we've ever done, how to add more RAM to your server, how to allow Java through your Windows Defender firewall. If you've port forwarded and your friends can't join the server, this is probably why. Do you have not allowed Java through your Windows Defender firewall? Why would you have, right? And so this shows you how to fix that. And then lastly, we have this, which is how to fix a broken Minecraft server. And it is just 20 minutes of me troubleshooting different Minecraft server issues and how to fix those issues. So nevertheless, that's kind of a general overview. Speaking of plugins, by the way, if you wanted to add those, you would just come back to the server directory here and then just drag and drop them right here into this plugins folder and then stop the server and start it back up. When the server was to start back up, these plugins would be installed and you would be good to go. So there you have it. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below and be sure to give this video a thumbs up if it helped you out. Enjoy your new paper server, any plugins you install with it, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.